missed the last two and playing well as that goes through the hands of Hyatt. And now Johnson with that burst of speed trying to throw it down. It went right back out to Cobb. What an assist for the three-pointer. But one man, arcing triple off the mark. But look at McConnell grabbing the rebound. On the reload. Andre Hyatt ties the game. McConnell slips it inside. Man, no, but a Murray, yes. Look out below. About his floor general. Cop in the corner. Great shot fake. Open look. And the second three of the day. Miami, they felt they should have won that Miami game Wednesday down in Florida. But came up on the short end late. McConnell, open look. Got it. Rutgers right now, they're a little bit of foul trouble. Six fouls. Trace Jackson Davis hasn't really been able to get on track here early. Kicks it out to an open Miller Cop, and Cop is feeling it in Jersey. He's got nine. Trace Jackson Davis recognizing the double coming over and finding his shooter on the weak side. Miller Cop, the Northwestern transfer, but on the other end, it's Andre Hyatt right at the basket. Just missing bunnies. So that's one where Jordan Geronimo, I don't know why he doesn't just go up and dunk it. There's the first two-point field goal via the freshman Malik Renu. Indiana facing their largest deficit. Miller Kopp already hit three. Mulcahy all over him. This time Kopp inside the arc. That's big time by Miller Kopp. Really good this year in assist to turnover. 33 assists, 14 turnovers before today's action. McConnell, tough fade away. Boy, that ends the drought for the Scarlet Knights. A tough shot. Can they get Jackson Davis on track? Amori playing with two fouls. He shoots it over him and scores it. It's going to be a tough guard because he just cannot pick up that third foul. Jackson Davis also dealing with a couple of ailments. Had a back injury. Boy, easy cut to the rim lane for Hyatt. The play by Miller Cobb, creating some contact and leaving it up to the officials to call it. Xavier Johnson wide open. Yes, and Indiana back to a one possession game. And Indiana will reset. Renew out of whack, but somehow gets it to Cobb, and Cobb ties the game at 33. The entire game's been played in a 10-point window. Xavier's led, or Rutgers by seven, their largest. Now Johnson with the steal. Johnson, stop and pop, and Indiana is in front. They're on a 9-0 run. They are trying to duck in Cliff Amore. Amore kicks it out. McConnell. Eyes flies and connects from distance. I don't like posting him up in this game because there's just going to be traps everywhere. What a cut by Derek Simpson. And he lays it in off the feed from Mulcahy. Here's the freshman Simpson. Boy, he is quick with a basketball. What a play by Derek Simpson. How about the confidence by Steve Peichel to come out of the timeout? Steve Peichel called him one of the most athletic guards he's ever coached. Meanwhile, on the other end, Xavier Johnson can't get it going. Simpson keeps it going. Back-to-back -back buckets for the freshman. Indiana, Robbie, they have not scored now in over four minutes. Bad time to hit a drought. Again, it's the freshman oh. Simpson. Largest lead of the game for Rutgers. And right now, Galloway gets it across the timeline, kicks to the corner. Here is Gunn. Trying to make something happen, and he turns it over. Up ahead, McConnell. Johnson feeds it to Jackson Davis, and he gets it to drop. I'd just like to see plays like that in the middle of the floor for Jackson Davis. Simpson has 11 points in the last six minutes for Rutgers, and that's their advantage right now. Finding Jackson Davis underneath, he collects and scores it. Jackson Davis, good pass. Geronimo rejected by Moore. Okay, he find a shoot up top. Simpson, huge, another big bucket for Derek Simpson. That's exactly what this freshman has done today. His father, Ron, was a good college player. Great move by Trace Jackson Davis. It has been a house of horrors for ranked teams. And that's the case again here today. Down goes number 10, Indiana.